Wait, what? Uh, okay. Yeah, my name is Violet Rose. And I am the queen of the nature. Check down below of our big video. And, um, uh, there's one else to say. It wasn't <laughs> Rosemary again. <laughs> Hello, everybody. We're back again after a nice, relaxing weekend. Yay. Today, uh, first, we got to thank uh, Miss. Shout out to Kiko1267 for naming her Voltageous friend, <gasps> Miss Violet Rose. That is officially her name now. Comment down um, below. What's she going to comment down below? She already has a name. Nope. Oh, come on. Oh, you're off your game today. Hey. So that's going to be her name. And you can I get her. To She'll be a Walmart something. exclusive because people have been asking. So like and she's mostly available in October. But we got the heads up from Mommy and Grace show that there'd be limited quantities available online. I got lucky, we got one. So, Miss Violet Rose, really good like to see them. you. Today, we are going to do, yes, they're $49.95, I believe. Today, we're going to do the boys' room, which Yay. is the last room well, in like that this unit. If I haven't said it in a while and you haven't realized, this unit, let me move my ladder, this unit and that unit is the left and right of a TV unit. If you can imagine, in the middle, there would have been a third piece which would have actually held the TV. So that would have been a very big wall unit. Um, when we bought it, we got it from a secondhand store, the Goodwill, it was uh, $40. It didn't have the middle piece, so luckily we got to get it. And these side pieces were pull-outs. When you pulled them out, it had shell, you pulled out this way, and then the all the there was all shelves, and it had DVD and CD player holders course we get it that so just a little information on the piece again so here we are up into the boys room Gracie has disappeared oh there she is well, I <clears> want to <throat> do something <laughs> this room is kind of fun for one because it's boys Ow. and we've got quite a few in here and for oh. two because everything in here was, was stuff that? that I purchased back in the day and oh. had oh, the Ben light up here had for um knowing that all these pieces had inspired me long ago like probably 10 15 years ago i bought these pieces Ooh. very little in this room is new besides the bed of course oh and i think i forgot to say the top of that was straight across oh grace is here again well, it was straight again. straight across this way those He's were like display shelves High. you can see in the beginning pictures of the first <laughs> video with the whole thing it was completely straight, had glass shelves, would have been for display. Oh um, Alex with a, what's it called, a plumb line. <laughs> um, he was able to <laughs> give it the angle he insisted because he said it'll look more like a house. I didn't care, but in the end, Whoa. he made a good decision. And I don't know if you noticed, this the piece here was, was Velcroed on, cake. covers the thing. It was on Gracie's birthday cake. We just cut yes. a little hole there. No knife. No, ten. Because we went to Grace's I thought I was a nine. We put a picture in the last video. So, on to the I'm boys' room. Say that. Which boys do we have in here? We have Deuce Gorgon. These are all wave ones. <laughs> well, not really Claude. Claude Will. That AKA... was the first Claude. Oh, yeah. AKA my brother. Right. Up here we have the um, clumsy guy. Um, Heath. Heath Burns. The tough guy, Manny. Yeah, he's a bully. And over here is... The, um, nerd. Jackson. Jackson. Well, he is a nerd. And, and naked kid. Nick. Gil. Gil. Gil Weber. And then there is a spot for Holt. But he's um, in But the... we like showing him off in a better spot. So, where do we begin here? Uh -huh. This room... The pillows? Was very inexpensive <laughs> since we already had the stuff. The flooring color is leftover paint <laughs> from one of our bathrooms. Wall paint. This I think is the color that is in our living room was left over. These little tidbits, we don't have the dolls, but we get little extras and stuff and things online, such as these shoes over here. Um ow, this others. is hurting my ears. Those were my favorite seller. Oh, something fell down. On <laughs> eBay is Angie Ness. She rotates her stuff very, very 
often. She's awesome about our best offers. She does fair prices. And if you have a few auctions you're trying over a matter of a few days, she's really good about holding on to those things so they can all ship at once. So if you need a good person for accessories, Angie Ness, check her out. Um, okay, so we got these trophies which came from, they're kind of scattered all about. They came from the dollar store. They were favors, party I favors. I think they were. Yeah, they were because remember. Uh, it was like seven for a dollar seven for a dollar um, this is kind of funny you can tell the age of it um, I definitely had that a long time ago the stereo system because it has a VCR with little tapes that do come in and out by the way and it has a cassette player which really really shows its age speakers are big which if you're my age you remember the bigger speakers the louder they were oh, which is yeah. not the case these days <coughs> excuse me uh, we have the TV, which is playing Avatar. Avatar, which is our favorite movie, which is why we wanted to show some respect for that. Mine is we um, absolutely German. No, oh, okay. I'm Monster High movies. Then we have little frames up here that show some of the other boys. Invisibility, Garrett, Slomo, and Who Dude. We do, oh yeah, we do have Garrett. He's right there. Okay, then we have some more of those things we cut out of magazines just to make some fun little signs. This was that electrostatic piece I told you about for real, real size rooms that once again just pieces here and there we've put scattered throughout the dollhouse. A little bit of glue on the back to hold it. The bed. The biggest cost in here. Um, these, I've talked about those pieces were pre-cut. I really can't explain how this was done. It was complicated. I had a lot of wood around me. And let me move Claude here. Oops. Not that again, obviously that's not waxed down to show it off a little better. I know the trim here would have been bought from Michaels or Lowe's, not sure which. Michaels has a lot cuter small stuff, but Lowe's has longer lengths for less money. So whichever. But I'm sure it would have been a frame and nailed these into that. I can see the nail holes. <laughs> and then put that on as an extra popsicle sticks for support and how I got those shelves on there I sincerely just do not remember I just wanted to give them something to give extra since they were piled on this was inspired by we went to a destroyer and a visiting family World War II destroyer. yeah destroyer and I looked down and I seen the Navy beds and they were like three three high and I was like oh I want to use that influence to give them really small areas later I hope to put maybe some pictures up on top and add a little to that as we move along it was screwed on up here to the wall that's how it stays and probably glued down here <clears throat> how can they climb up the thing they what climb up the thing by going like this that was our invention for that or whatever you want to say the small the larger is for the two boys Jekyll and Hyde of course his is wider if we get closer you can see Gracie did all of these letters and her interpretation of them we have all the um, art posters to represent learning what movies they came from um, show you all that we have the pet there with <laughs> what's the pet's name Alex it is Sorry, someone's watching football down there. Yeah. Hopefully we can't. Um, crossfade. What's the red one's name, Grace? Oh, um, geez, I'm stumped. Can't remember. Maybe it's both crossfade. Who knows? This one is interesting because Gracie had lost her. She had gotten the original crossfade with um, her Jackson. And then we ended up with two of these. So you can, what is the red one's name? Is it Crossfade too? Yeah. Crossfade. Well, they're both Crossfade? Well, because Holt and that sounds pretty much the same okay. body. So we ended up with two of these, something I ordered and it came with an extra. We and were going to resell it, but then I thought, well, I don't want to buy a Crossfade. So if you notice he's shinier, 
I actually painted him. And mom completely tricked me that she bought a green yeah. prospect. Yeah, the main way you can tell is because he's got the gloss because I put sealant on him. I'm like, but I just you used... bought another crossfire and she's like, nope. I'm like, you painted it? Yeah, I think I did a pretty darn good job. I lost it on my dad. Well, some people would say we're crazy. Pet daycare. Yeah, that was quite, that was one of our first boy. That was your first boy. Yep. So that was quite a while ago. I got it for like... Well, so I primed it and then was able to paint it. As I was telling you, this product, you cannot beat it. This primer does literally work on everything. And um, I used to be a house painter and I still paint my own house and family and stuff like that. I cannot tell you how awesome this primer is. I have literally painted shiny ceramic tiles with this and backsplashes and it's been fine this is a really good project on the sticky uh, the plastic stuff if you gave it lots of abuse it would come out and as a bit of handy this comes in a can and it comes in spray so it's handy for each but what i do if this is a helpful little tip of mine i get one of those shampoo bottles for traveling and i put some in there so whenever i just want to pull it because it's you know kind of a pain in the butt to open the can i just mm. flip that up squirt a little like regular craft paint you can prime everything in a second. It takes a little extra soap to wash it, but it is water-based. I hope that helps you. So the beds, as we said, got all their little pictures there to show all their BFFs or <laughs> girlfriends or whatever. Girl whoever sleeps there, their portrait, box art if we have it. Sorry about that flash. The different wonderful movies to remember. For Deuces, I would have loved to put Clash of the Titans, but ah. nothing really had a good picture of Medusa as the parent. <laughs> I love what Gracie did with her interpretations of all those letters for everybody. That's pretty good. <laughs> These beds are made from the mattresses. That's just a piece of foam. Try to do that to give it a different color. It's made, let me pull one out. All the pillows were all the same. I'm gonna put a little continuity in here. And all some fabric I had. I love peacocks. I was going to do a pillow for myself and I ended up using it for that. Can you hold that for me right there? This oh, one is an old really sheet good. that had a hole and wasn't oh, yeah. usable for us, but the rest of it was good material. So I just made all of theirs the same. Kind of the same sewing style as Rochelle's with the boxed out look. I didn't do differences on there because they're so high. This is actually a hard room to play in. And instead of making the blanket unattached, I attached it kind of like a sleeping bag style. Again, this is this room being so high is very hard to uh, get to. So, you know, I kind of went a little short on that. Over here we have Manny. We'll move him out of the way. That whole bathroom set was, as I told you, something I had. It was definitely Barbie. It was definitely pink. Used the primer and the spray. The counter, I think everything on this was painted. The little pieces, of course, the accessories were from various things. And whatever I want a different change of color, we just used the nail polish and the primer kind of thing. When you're hanging towels like this, they usually don't stay. I just put a little dab of glue gun in there to make them hold and stay better. The lights were white to make them look more like lights, I thought. I just put a little yellow nail polish on there. Maybe later I'll paint in some of those tiles different colors. Um, towels, easy to make. Cut them, fold them. Just when you put um, the glue gun on, don't squeeze it really hard because it'll indent. Just hold it very lightly and it'll give you the shape you want. Again, I used that fray check so I didn't have to worry about those coming undone. And of course, how would you hem that? Toilet papers came from Gary Mini Builder. The background is um, scrapbook paper, just hot Mod Podge on. <coughs> Although I didn't put Mod Podge on top, and there's an effect. Let me see if we can see that. Don't mind me, I'm on a little ladder to do this. You can see the striping effect. You put a piece of tape and then you put the secondary Mod Podge on with a different sheen. And that gave you, I just wanted to add a little bit, make it look like paneling. Let me see if I can get, you see right there where there's a difference? So mask it off with the blue painter's tape. Use a different sheen, it adds a little something. The skull and crossbones is from Michaels. 
and we've seen those baskets everywhere. I just used two tiles for the floor in that area to give a little separation. Um, the bathtub, of course, you can see it's pretty obvious. That's just you know, Easter basket stuffing. Kind of handy to make them not be empty in the tub, but of course we don't want water up here. That's definitely not allowed in this room. Water to drink, that's it. Um, this was definitely my old stuff. I knew I was so inspired by this piece. I knew I wanted a workout room and it used to be over here. Oh, Claude has taken over this spot. And it was over here until we got Manny and then we had to fit. So this is a hard spot, fit Manny in here, which really worked out well because he's so big that he's kind of hard to put anywhere else. He has his M the learning for him and his maze and of course he's afraid of mazes pepsi my favorite soda kind of fun to put those personal things in there his m we made simple gave him a little pet giraffe for fun i got super lucky with this i got that for ten dollars that's his jacket and it actually fits him that hangs there with things we kind of interpret as manny eating pretzels for the salt to stay healthy his big cup of coffee his orange juice now his spot Gracie did bail on me. She can't help me with these. His spot we kind of did like a gym mat. I think you've seen this red. We use the, uh, yeah, we've seen this definitely. We use the brown going with him. Use that same thing. It's kind of like a yoga mat, we call it. Just on the outside did the stitching, keep it simple. So he rolls that out for his thing. So he's got a mat. And then, or sorry, that would be a blanket. And his mat is obviously had to be very big to fit him. Oh, little power. This side was something we've seen in Rebecca's area, the fake leather. Or no, no, not Rebecca's area, Gilda's. His I just did around the edges again, and then just put small little catch stitches to hold the banting, the puffiness inside. This side was two of those. Oh God, you get them from the dollar store They for cleaning lenses and um, computer screens. Just sewed two of them together and then used the one side. So he's got a kind of neat mat. And luckily he fits here. Oops. Again, with the towels, you can see with this example when you just cut them. These, of course, are just dollar store hand towels. We've scattered those all around. They become handy. Uh, looks like I put a little stitching in that one for fun probably because it was showing we like Gil we have extras over here or whatever their accessories just kind of hanging there once again that's waxed down so we don't have to worry about that too much a couple little things that are gonna hope to put more on the wall there's just some silly little signs of course Gary mini builder we found the tissues at <clears throat> I actually stuck with him because most people sold them one one thing of toilet paper he sold like I think it was four or five for the same price as one on most other sites so I really liked him and was interested all of their pets are there who has them I think I already talked about that I don't think there's much more oh besides Deuce over here kind of chilling out with the pizza it's probably my favorite little nail polish treat you've seen Deuce's video in the little opening package thing we had with Dawn of the Dance Claudine. So that's kind of handy up there now until we hopefully get lucky enough. I was telling you how we got the three Holt, Deuce, and Wave 1 um, Torlai, and the only thing he was missing was his bracelet, which hopefully will come someday. Total price, each one was just a little bit more than they would have cost originally. We got super lucky on that deal. Uh, I think that's it. We'll add more little things around this room as we move on. I'd like to put something in here. I'd like to put a little bit more stuff on the wall. Not sure, but I'll get there. So lastly, I think we want to do some shout outs because this room was all full of pieces I bought in the past that inspired me on what I knew I wanted to do in the future. Fast forward 20 years, finally got to it. So I just wanted to pull out some people who have used the word that they were inspired in different reasons and give them shout outs. So my first shout out is AG Pals with Cookies. 
she, um, her dad, she asked to make something like this. He couldn't, and that's okay. This is, you know, it's hard and has parts to it, and people working make it hard. But she was inspired to maybe make and start her own dollhouse with cardboard box and cardboard pieces. So I love that attitude, and sweet girl, I hope you do that. Jacqueline Perez left a really nice message that she was inspired to make her dreams come true. Again, I just love the positivity of that comment. And so this shout out is for you, Jaqueline. J-O-A-Q-U-I-N Perez. Thank you for commenting, thank you for watching. Um, as well, Veronica Wilder. She was inspired to do something like this in her house for her sister. That big time made me smile. That's exciting. My heart just filled with how much her sister and her will love doing that together and share special memories like Gracie and I am. Good luck and let me know how you do because I do want to see it. Lastly for today is Nira Sky, Skay, S-K-A-I. Shout out to you. She as well is inspired. She said specifically inspired by both of us and wonderful. I am so glad to hear those things. Of anything, we hope to share this with people, not only not showing off, but sharing what we built and our artistic stuff to influence people to do awesome things and be creative. Thank you for sharing that you are inspired. Um, next is going to be Haunted for a special Sam O'Hare. Sam O'Hare? Sam O'Hare? Who's been waiting patiently. So that will be, we're going to take a break from the big house and get to something different with some details. Oh, I love the way the lights are sparkling on that. Oh, look at <laughs> that is she came back. My daughter came back to join in with me. So, oh, that is just so pretty. That's what I imagined between the twinkle from the stickers. Anyway, hope you enjoyed this video. We will hopefully do another one really soon. Hope you enjoyed this one. Have a wonderful night. Thanks for watching. Uh, don't forget to look at the video below of the whole house in one if you haven't seen it. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe and share. Bye-bye. <laughs>